Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Tech back with another video and I hope you remember me because it's been a while since I uploaded a video. Long time no see, huh? So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can live stream on Mixer with Streamlabs on iOS devices. So let's get the party started guys and this time I'll try to make it as simple as possible to understand and it's gonna be quick. All you need to do is just go to Safari and search for Mixer.com. After this you need to sign in with the Mixer ID and you have to tap Broadcast Dashboard. And this will take to your page in the Broadcast section. You need to sign in with your Microsoft ID right here. And once you sign in and you are successfully logged in, you will see this page about how you can get started with the live streaming. So you have to tap get started from here and quite a few steps you need to follow here. So first you need to review the rules and here is a video about how you can live stream, what you have to avoid, what you can keep from uploading some illegal stuff. You need to follow this or else you will be banned even after you get approved. You cannot skip this video watch it very carefully and once this video gets over you will see that next step button will become visible and you can now tap it so now as you can see the video is over so we are proceeding further tap next step you need to request a stream key from them so tap the request button from here and now you have to wait 24 hours since they approve you so wait 24 hours and see so once you get approved with the third step you just need to tap next next and then we are done so now we are not gonna wait for 24 hours to approve i'm gonna use my real mixer id the original one to show you how you can live stream directly with streamlabs all right so once you get approved you will see in the same broadcast section that there are now features available about your stream video and even the stream key so that's how you can set up your stream and it's all the actions that are required for the video and then at last you can tap save so once you're approved and done with setting up your stream you need to go to streamlabs and then you have to tap the mixer icon from here so that you can sign in with mixer and this is something the screen will look like when you tap it then again you have to tap sign in with microsoft id because mixer is microsoft and from here just sign in once you signed in you will see these options what you can do and then just tap approve or else you won't be able to live stream so these are some basic things that streamlabs are required in order to stream and these are some widgets now just tap get started and this is where you are in the in the streamlabs application so if you can remember from the previous screen that i was live streaming pubg mobile with my friends so here's the title of the video once your stream is set up from that browser page and here it will show you like this if you want to stream directly from the application just tap that live stream red colored button in the center and you're good to go but if you want to live stream your screen that is so you have to do is go to control center from there and just long press on the recording button from here and then tap live stream and just tap start broadcasting and as i just tap the start broadcast button that means i am live you can see it says start recording you can check it right there on top at the status bar and that means that my whole screen is being streamed live you can check that in the mixer app i will show you you just need to wait a while here i guess and oh yeah it's not showing i guess but just look at that just look at that live button from here that means we are live and it's because of my damn internet it's not really good that's why it isn't showing but if you have a really good internet you can live stream in 60 fps and even more than that so from here i will tap view my stream and then watch and i guess the live stream has started already it's just because of my internet and uh, all right it's yeah here it is you can see this is the box and it's loading because it's the screen that i was in before and this is a live stream that means we are successful now and it's been live streaming everything that i've done before on this screen and I will show you just wait a second and all right now we are in my profile and you can see the background the live stream has started and we are successfully done this thing so all right that's how you can live stream on mixer using streamlabs just watch the video carefully and follow the steps very carefully hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did press the like button let me know thanks for watching peace out